Hello, this is Andrew with Missing Remote. This was supposed to be a review of these two high-end Thunderbolt 4 docking stations. This is a Cal Digit TS4, and this one is a Sonatec Echo 20. They're both high-end Thunderbolt docking stations that should work well with any Thunderbolt 4 laptop. Assuming, of course, that that laptop actually supports Thunderbolt 4 properly. That's how we get to where this video is actually going to go. This is an LG Gram 16 2-in-1 laptop. But the problem I'm going to talk about impacts every LG laptop with Thunderbolt 4 and maybe 3, which is very disappointing because overall, I really like this LG Gram 16. Great display, great form factor, excellent battery life. Keyboard could be better, but that's a niggle. And it has two NVMe ports in the bottom, so it's easy to add storage if you want. So what's the gripe about these Thunderbolt 4 docking stations? Do they not work at all? No, they kind of work. And by kind of work, I mean some things work okay. Multi-display, check. USB-AC connectivity, for the most part, check. Where we get into trouble is with the networking and SD card support. The network interface card, or NIC, this one is a Realtek 2.5 gig NIC. This one is an Intel 2.5 USB attached NIC. In both of these docks, it doesn't work for every LG laptop. The networking does not work in either of these docks. And from what I gather from LG support, is that the same is true for every Thunderbolt 4 docking station. The NIC does show up in Windows, and you can get an IP address, but it won't route traffic. Moreover, if you plug in a USB NIC, another third-party USB NIC, into either station, the exact same thing happens. Windows recognizes the device, you get an IP address, but it will not route traffic over that network interface card, and it basically just blows up networking on the, on the computer. SD card support is a little bit weird. And if it was just one of these docks or everything else worked, but, but the SD card, I would be inclined to blame the dock or maybe they share the same SD card reader, but that's not, that's not the case. They will read FAT32 formatted cards, but not EXFAT. And it works exactly the same way as a networking problem, where if I plug a USB-A or C, SD card reader into either dock, it will read FAT32 cards, but it will not read EX FAT cards. Given this, I have a really hard time seeing how it's not LG's fault. I contacted the support about it, and they have opened a normal ticket and a voice of the customer ticket. One of the CSRs I spoke with was very helpful. I'm mostly making this video because I can't find any solid documentation around this, this problem. It's surprising to me that I can't find any documentation that, that points out that LG laptops just, just don't work with Thunderbolt docking stations when it comes to the networking. Hopefully LG can resolve this problem in a timely way. I really would like to use either one of these docking stations to get multi-monitor support, keyboard support, and of course, wired e ethernet support for my LG Gram laptop. If you have a pressing need for an external dock, it is possible to buy an LG multi-hub if you can find one. I haven't been able to get my hands on one easily and I'm not quite ready to start scouring eBay. And it doesn't support all the things that these Thunderbolt 4 docks support. So it would be a poor compromise. Hopefully you found that useful. If you did, go ahead and like the video and subscribe to the channels. If you have any questions or comments, drop them below and I will get to them as soon as I can. Thanks.